What's going on everyone? Steven here, back with episode 2 of my Elix Let's Hack series. Today we're going to talk about finding infinite jetpack fuel so you don't run out of fuel with your jetpack. All right. So you get the jetpack really, really, really early on. Uh, so the value happens to be a float. So um, I have opened the Elix process with Cheat Engine and now I'm going to select float from here um, and Let's start for uh, or with a search for an unknown initial value. All right. And now let's go ahead and use up the jetpack as much as we can and hit escape. And now this is a changed value. You could try increase, decrease, but sometimes when things count down, the value will actually be counting up. So you could double your time by getting it wrong if it's not increased, decreased, if it's instead like decreased, increased. So, you know, a lot of times I like to just do changed, unchanged, and whittle it down pretty quickly. So I'm going to go to change value, next scan. All right, and now I'm going to go unchanged, because we know the value hasn't changed since our last scan. All right, I have hotkeys set up for that, so I'm just going to use those. And this can be a quick way to whittle down some values. So let's get back in the game. <clears throat> so it's changing. So I'm just holding changed while it's changing. Now I'll wait for it to fill all the way up. All right, do changed. And now do unchanged. All right, now you can like move around. Do unchanged. All right, so we've got 18 results here. Looking through these results, this one's looking pretty promising right here. All right, so let's double click that and let's see what happens. Watch the value as I fly up. All right, your health has decreased. So I keep getting hurt, but whatever, it's okay. Um, so now this looks like our value. Look, as it's filling up, this is counting up. So now that we need to do, let's right click and say find out what writes to this address. Looks like we have an instruction continuously writing, but let's see what happens when we actually use the jetpack. All right, that bottom instruction runs. So now if we click this and we say more information and click the F here, we can see our floating point and XMM registers. Look what's in XMM1. 139.54. So as you use the jetpack, this is counting down and it's writing that to the memory address. So now we can just go show disassembler and presumably we can just nop this instruction out and not have it do anything, which should not write any value. So we can count our bytes here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 bytes. You could say tools auto-assemble. You could do an AOB injection if you want, uh, which might persist through some updates and stuff that they do with the game. I'm just going to go ahead and cook something up really quick here. Enable, disable. Need these two sections and a script. I'm going to say elix.exe plus seven five six three one nine colon. All right, and that's here the memory address that has this instruction in it. All right, so you can right click here, copy the clipboard, bytes only. All right, so in our disable section, x.exe plus 756319. All right, in our disable section, whoops, let's do a plus. We can go db this, which you know, sometimes I like to keep a note of what that instruction is. Move SS, REX plus zero, 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 zero. We don't need to write all those zeros, but I'm just going to do exactly what I see. All right. And then for this one, what we can do is say DB, and we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bytes. So let's just do eight knobs. All right. And then that's it. Let's go File, Assign to Current Cheat Table, 
Okay, let's close this and this. And here we can say infinite jetpack. Let's enable that. And here this instruction changed to no operation. Let's re-enable it. All right, and the original instruction is back. Bam, we enable that. Let's see what happens. Infinite jetpack. All right, so the next thing that you need, which I'm going to do in the next video, is infinite health. Because if you drop down right now and hit the ground, you are toast. So just use the jetpack right before you hit the ground. And we're good. All right, so that is infinite jetpack. Um, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Go check out the other ones. I'm going to have a whole playlist for this game set up, so make sure you check those out. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll talk to you all in the next video. Take care.